It is a lightweight bout between Raging Al Iaquinta and Donald Cerrone. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight scrap. Cerrone is four years his senior. He is four inches taller. He will have a three-inch reach advantage. And now to get us started, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer, holding a professional record of 32 wins, 10 losses, and one no contest. He stands six feet one is tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, USA, Donald Cowboy Sarone! And now he's going to support Fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 13 wins, 3 losses, and 1 draw. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of World Cup, New York, Raging Al Iquinta! And with the attributes, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. Herb Dean, our referee for this one. You ready to fight? Ready. Do it. We are ready to go with round one here. Cerrone gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Blocks the shot. They have started this fight off with a brawl. Very nice leg kick for him there. Can't take too many of those. Now mixing one into the body. Nice shot. Oh, man, with that right leg kick. Oh, he got cracked with the jab there, Joe, and his head is firmly on the center line, the one place it really can't afford to be. He's showing some vulnerability here by leaning right into his opponent's range. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here. Back to the feet now. Oh, the fence is shaking after that slam, Joe. He's working from half guard now. He hits him with a hammer fist. He's doing a great job of ground and pound here. Ripping to the body and to the head, staying busy. Big punch from the top. We cross the midpoint in round one. Half guard now. Half guard here. Back to the guard position. Excellent ground and pound here, not giving his opponent any breaks. Well, as usual, suffocating work from the top here by Raging Ally Aquin. Just over two minutes to go. Oh, and he's back up again. Those get-ups have been there for him all night. Fainting with the punch. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Iaquinta. That knee might have landed there. Jockey in for position here on the clinch. Both fighters trying to get a more dominant position. Oh, big elbow! Oh! He's got him hurt here. Nice leg kick. How about that shin? Jab effectively here. It's an underutilized weapon by a lot of fighters, not this guy. Nice jab by Cowboy Silver. Look at this. One, two punch by Aya Kuta. Oh, nice job staying busy. The offensive onslaught continues. Oh, very impressive. Big shot there. That's a nice one, too. Final second to round one. Second round, straight ahead. You ready to fight? Ready. Here we are, early round two. Now starting off this round, he might still be hurt. He's gonna wanna look to be defensive and move and avoid getting hit and try to recover. 
Mixes it up. Cerrone's bruise on that thigh is just nasty. It's gonna be hard getting out of bed in the morning. Let's see how he chooses to proceed here. He's doing a great job of timing these shots. Right back to the jab and snaps the head back yet again. Tagged him. See the total strikes. Oh, he continues to effectively use his jab here, much like he did in the previous round, Joe. Nice punch there by Cowboy Cerrone. Excellent job of landing punches here. Oh, he blocked that offense, Joe. He's doing a great job blocking these shots. He's moving to his left, trying to avoid the big power in his opponent's left hand. Cerrone's leg appears to be hurt here, Joe. That is an obvious limp. Some nice back and forth action here. Well, he eats a punch to the head. Oh, wow. This could be it. Now they're both throwing with power. Oh! And now he lands a combination. He hurt him with that hook. He is going after it here. Oh, very nice. Oh, right hand is there for him, Joe. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. That landed. Big left punch. Oh, he's landed some good shots here. He's teeing off with some vicious shots. He blocks the punch. And they clinch once again. Well, he has landed some good shots tonight, Joe, but as yet, he has been unable to string together any solid combinations, and that has served to keep his opponent in this fight. So let's see if he can change up the tempo a little bit with his strikes and try to put together a combination that is more damaging to his opponent. Oh, nice work here in the clinch as the hook connects. Strong work up against the fence by Cowboy Cerrone. Tying him up here in the clinch. Oh, gets the takedown late in the round here, Joe. In half guard. Cerrone's lower jaw now, Joe, started to show some signs of swelling. Nice shot to the head. Oh, he went for a triangle here. He's got it. To the arm bar. Very nice transition. there. Well, you got to love this performance here tonight, Joe. He continues to land a high number of strikes just as he did in the previous round and seemingly not slowing down at all here tonight. Connects there with the punch. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. Yeah, the hand's going here early. He's keeping busy here, connecting with a lot of punches. Oh, nice punch there by Aya Quinta. Able to check that kick as well. Nice combination there. Constantly a moving target. Oh! He's got to be careful here. He's clearly in trouble. Vicious combinations. How about that chin? Man, Joe, he continues to leave that head open. His opponent's got to be salivating at this point in time. That jab has been there all night. You got to get that head off the center line. How clean is that jab by Cowboy Cerrone? He's gonna try to take the back, I think. And now he's got both hooks in. In half guard position. Oh, and he's able to land a strike there from the bottom. Nicely done by Aya Quinta. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. He's moved to full guard. Well, just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw offense. Staying busy here. You like to see that, Joe. Oh, hammer fist here by Cowboy Cerrone. It appears that cut is getting worse. 
He's back to full mount again. Good punch. Less than two minutes with which to work here. He's posturing up here. Back to full guard. Wow. He's moved back to half guard. Now he's the full mount again. Oh man, I love it. He's in full guard here. He's looking for the triangle. Transitions to the armbar. 